Hello everybody, in today's video I'm going to show you how to share your screen while live streaming on YouTube. The process is actually pretty simple, so let's just get into it. So the first thing you're going to want to do is download a live streaming or screen recording software on your computer. The most popular one is OBS Studio and it's going to be the one I'm going to show you how to use in this video. So go ahead and search on Google OBS Studio and install it. It's pretty easy to find and once it's installed you want to go ahead and open it. So this is going to be what it looks like when you open it up for the first time. OBS will probably ask you a couple of questions such as what you'll use it for and it'll probably ask to check your computer specifications so it'll get the best settings. The first thing we're going to want to do before recording our screen is make sure that our audio is working correctly. To do that you want to come to this audio mixer section here and then under desktop audio you want to click on these three dots and then click on properties. From here you want to click on device and then select the headphones or speakers that you use and then click on OK. If you plan on streaming with a microphone and want people to hear that also you want to come down under mic and aux and click on the three dots here and then click on properties again. And then like before come to device and then go ahead and select the microphone that you use and then click OK. So now if you play something on your computer or you speak in your mic that should be caught right here. And if you want to turn down the volume for one of them you just need to adjust these dials right here accordingly. Alright so now to go ahead and share our screen the first thing we're going to want to do is make sure you have a scene selected. If you want to make a new scene you can by clicking on this plus sign down here and then you can go ahead and give your scene a name. For this video I'll name it share screen test and then click on OK. And then now we want to come over to this sources section over here and then click on the plus sign here. And then you want to click on display capture. You can go ahead and give this a different name if you want and then click OK. And then now is where you can capture your monitor. Keep the capture method at automatic and then under display if you have multiple displays you can choose which one you want. I'm just going to keep it as my primary. And then here you can choose whether you want your mouse cursor to be captured or not. I'll just leave it checked on. I'll leave this unchecked and then click on OK. And now as you can see on the preview our screen is being captured. So the next thing we're going to have to do is connect OBS Studio to our YouTube channel so we can actually stream. Alright so now I'm switched over to YouTube and once you're here you want to go ahead and click on this button up here that says create. And then you want to click on go live. Once you're here you want to make sure that you have stream selected on the side. And then make sure you're on the stream settings tab here. And then you want to come all the way down until you see the stream key section. Now you can go ahead and look at your stream key here if you want, but all you really need to do is copy it. Now that we have our stream key copied, we'll just head back over to OBS and you want to come to the top corner and click on file, then settings, and then come to stream. And then on service, you want to go ahead and open it up and select YouTube. Now here you want to come down and select use stream key and then just go ahead and paste that stream key in there. Then once you do that just hit on apply and then OK and then you should be able to stream to your YouTube channel. If this video ended up helping you, a like and subscribe would be greatly appreciated.